Hi friends, my name is Alladi Lohit Kumar. I've joined Akash for my JEE preparation in two years program in my class 11. I got to know about Akash through my father. Uh, he got to know it about uh, through the internet and through the ad. I joined Akash because it was near to my home and it was greatly suggested my friends, uh, relatives and seniors because of the results uh, and their previous experiences. Akash has very good faculty uh, who has enough experience and qualifications to clear the, all the doubts and explain the concepts and Akash provides a good competitive environment by giving good test series like our AATS and FTS test series. In my class 8, I decided to pursue engineering. My mother is a primary school teacher. She has a dream of seeing me as an engineer and I also like robotics and AI personally and from class 8 so I thought engineering would be the best way to achieve greater heights in robotics and AI and chose AI and robotics as my dream and started the journey through Akash Baijus. Uh, coming to the subjects, physics, uh, like I had a problem with the chapter of waves and oscillations but my faculty has helped me with the chapters uh, by explaining the concepts thoroughly and giving me more illustrations and examples. So the question it given is the starting with an concentration of all are equal one molarity. Uh, one one molar. So it's one one molarity, is good, right? Mm. Chemistry, I was struggling with the organic chemistry initially. Uh, my teacher made it easy for me by uh, making me practice more questions, and it became easy. And now I love organic chemistry. Maths had a problem with the chapters of straight lines and conics. Uh, since the questions were very lengthy and I used to do calculation errors. Akash I Tutor is a very good app where we can see our recorded lectures and give the tests uh, through uh, the Akash I Tutor. And the tests in the Akash I Tutor were on par with the actual JE mains and advanced examinations, uh, which made me feel very confident about my final exam. Uh, and you, because of the test provided by Akas, the AATS or the FTS, I feel uh, very confident about my J. You know, the last month is uh, really crucial, but we should not get stressed in the last month. I used to give mock tests regularly in the last month, uh, which made me improve my uh, consistency in the tests. And also, I used to do error analysis uh, after every single test and clarify my doubts uh, with the teachers. They're asking how much D at equilibrium, correct? D at equilibrium. So, reactants concentration decreasing with the Decreases. time, practice increasing. increasing. Right. I did not learn anything new in the last month. I just revised what all I studied before and I concentrated mainly on the topics which had good weightage in the JE mains. The final test series actually helped me a lot. Uh, they made me habituate to the test pattern and the time constraint of the JE mains. And also the questions uh, in my final test series uh, were mostly on par with the actual JE mains questions and uh, giving this uh, FTS uh, regularly uh, made me consistent and uh, understand where I am lacking in my concepts. Uh, after every test I used to do my error analysis uh, which made me understand uh, where I am lacking and work upon them and this FTS uh, series, uh, test series has made me improve a lot in my JE mains preparation. I advise all the JE aspirants to be determined in this two years journey and never lose confidence. Uh, we should be giving uh, the tests regularly. We should not miss any tests which improves our consistency and confidence in the exams and which I also did and preparing for JE there will be a lot of distractions as we know and the major one is social media. Uh, like as prevention is better than cure it's better if you stop using your social media before you start your JE's preparation, which I also did. And there will be many doubts for us. Uh, just don't pile them up. We should clarify our doubts. Uh, especially, we should not use the internet and we should consult our teachers for the doubts and get them clarified as soon as possible. I wish all the JE aspirants all the best and thank you.